what's up? I have another unboxing and this one comes all the way from China. So Okay, <laughs> this one's gonna take some time to open. Maybe not. Cool. What is this? What what could this be? A little background on this. Uh, It's a new product. It's a new. Oh wait, it's got a little thing. A new version of a knuckle roller, a knuckle bone. So I've been anxious to open this. Wow. It looks like they're interchangeable pieces, yeah. So, so far this is, these are two pieces, as you can see. Those are two pieces right there. We're gonna screw in, those are the end parts. So screw into the knuckle bone, or I guess knuckle roller. I really don't know what the proper terminology is. Okay, they're numbered, this is, One, three, four, five. Uh, what else is here? What else is here? What else is okay, now this one. Me too. This is all taped up. Okay. It's like totally childproof, I can see. And I'm, uh, I'm not very good with childproof stuff. It's kind of hard for me to open things sometimes. Let's see. I'm getting closer. Right, I can feel it. It looks really cool. A little piece I can see here. Oh, come on. This is all taped up. I think it should have worked out today. Oh. Okay, here we go, here we go. Getting closer, almost. I just want all these pieces together before I start opening them. Oh, cool. I guess I should have opened this one last. Spinner, dude. I got a spinner. I got a really cool looking one, too. Look at that. Check that out. Um, I want to say that this comes from... Well, someone reached out to me from the Knuckle Roller group, and I'll put I'll put all that info. But I didn't get any. I didn't get. There's no. There's no there's like. I got no paperwork. I'll just put all that stuff later. Shall we? Shall we put all that information later and just see them for right now for what they are? Once I, <laughs> once I get to them, <laughs> bear with me, let's see, okay, okay, <clears throat> okay, here's, here is, two more, two more little packages, I guess I'm going to open, 
I'm just opening them randomly to see what what they all are. See what everything is. Okay, another piece, another little piece. So I'm assuming there's two different sizes, possibly more so far that I can see. Sweet. Okay, so there's smaller sizes compared to the other, and these are the end parts that are fitting together with a middle piece, is what I gather from this. This is my best guess. Okay, two more other packages. I must say these are these are packaged really really uh, intensely. Oh, okay, that's even smaller. It's even smaller size of the end parts. I'm not very good with terminology for, yeah, th this is like a interchangeable knuckle roller with different sizes, different pieces that you screw together. So here is, let me see, I'm going to hold it, here is a smaller, so I'm going to hold it this way. So there's the smallest one, this is like a medium size. Small. This seems to be the large. I'm not done. There's one. <laughs> there's, well, actually, there's two more. There's two more. So. Um. <laughs> Ah, childproof. It's packaged very well. I, I can see that they did not get damaged in any kind of way. Okay, and here's another. Maybe this is the extra large size. Because, yeah, it feels like it is. Um, wait. Ah, okay, it's the medium. So we have a large, medium, small, and a mini size end pieces. I will show them all to you here in just a little bit. So this is, so that right there is, I'm gonna put them in proper order. Okay, here's the bone, or the middle piece, whatever the proper name for it is. This is, is there something in right here? Or is this just tape stuff? It's just tape. Ha, ah, okay, here's the middle piece. So, this is the large. This is the medium. This is the small, and this is the mini size. So let's start with the smallest one first. I like how they are easily to screw. Oh, look how pretty. Look how pretty that is. That's just like super, super pretty. Wow. Okay, so the mid, the midsection is very thin. It's very narrow. The midsection is very narrow. Um, it's gonna take me a while to get used to because the, the, the roller that I currently have is a thicker midsection. It's not as narrow. So, I'm going to try different piece. This is the small. That was the mini. 
Very small. It looks very sleek. I like how how sleek it looks. Okay, it feels a little easier for me to maneuver. I can see that it's going to be one of those uh, adjustments I would have to get used to because of how narrow the center is for me. And it does have a heavier weight. It has a heavier weight for each bigger size. So let me go to the medium. Okay, so here is and these screw in pretty easily. There we go. This is the medium. I can see like as uh, the bigger that it gets, the end pieces the easier it is for me to maneuver, so I'm thinking it's going to be one of those deals for me that the biggest size will probably be the easiest for me to get used to and then I'd have to work my way down to the smaller ones. But I like the, I like the, what do you call it? I like the difference in sizes and, and your options that you have. Like, I don't know if they're going to come this way if you purchase these. This is the large. This is the large end piece. And let's see what I Yeah. It's a little more. Um, seems a little. It feels really good. It feels. Um, well, it feels very sleek. It has a sleek design. It's uh, the midsection may be a little longer than I'm used to. I think I'm possibly going to be better at using the medium size. But I like the options, and I like how you can uh, switch them out easily. So I think I think this one might be my sweet spot right here. But it is gonna take me a while to get used to the shape of it. Oh, these are this is pretty cool. This is really cool. I want to thank Adrian. Adrian de Sousa. I want to thank you, Adrian. I want to thank you for um, for wanting my opinion, and and I'm very grateful for this opportunity that you that you sent this to me. I like it. I think it's a very cool design. It's different than what I'm used to. But I, I don't see how I can't get used to using it. It's just a, a bit of adjustment. I like the interchangeable pieces. It's easy to interchange. These are definitely cool. Okay, so thank you, Adrian. Thank you for sending me these. I'm really digging. You know what? I think the small end pieces are working better for me right now. I'm starting to get used to it a little bit. I'm getting a little more smooth with it. So it's just going to take me a while to adjust to the shape and the size. But they look sexy. I mean, the, the shape of it just looks so sleek. I, I can't even... Yeah, I gotta play with these some more and see if I can uh, get a really decent flow going. Thank you, Adrian. 
for sending me these. And I really dig the spinner too, by the way. The spinner is awesome. I got into the spinner thing, the spinner craze. But I didn't get one of these one of these shapes. I just got like, you know, the typical dollar store version. This really spins, dude. This is this is an awesome little spinner. Thank you. So yeah, I'll be back with um, a more in-depth review of what, what I think of how my uh, overall thoughts are, my final thoughts are, and then I'll probably um, make some trick clips. Yeah? Thank you, Adrian. And uh, I'll be back. Okay, my overall thoughts of Dam Designs Modular Knuckle Roller. I really like them. I think they're really cool. They're different from anything that's out there right now because of the shape. They have a really slender midsection and that allows you to, to play easily if you're an advanced player, if you have bigger fingers. Uh, it just makes it easier for that. But it is a challenge, so you know I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna lie. My small hands, but I was able to learn different tricks that I wouldn't have normally gotten into if I wouldn't have tried these. So I want to thank you, Adrian from Dan Designs, for fronting me these, and letting me try them, giving you my honest opinion, of what I think about them. They dropped already, so you may want to get in on that and cop yourself some. You got stainless steel for $50 and they have another version. They have titanium for 60 So that's really not bad of a price. If you think about it, you got four different options. So it's really four knuckle rollers that you're getting. And they also have a hole at the end. These don't because these are prototype. The ones that are being sold have a hole so you can easily use them as beggary. So that's four sets of beggary, if you think about it, for 50 or for 60, depending on what you want. But I think it's definitely worth it. You should check it out. Damn designs. Damn designs.